Welcome back, Captains. We're over here down at the Dunlop and Boat Ramp. This is on the west side, and I call it the Rookie Ramp. You might have saw the video from yesterday. If not, I'll put a link in the description. Well, this guy that you see here swam both those jet skis over to the ramp, and now he's struggling even more. They got the trailer backing in, looking pretty good. He's got a little bit of sideways slither right there. But all in all, nice and smooth. Now we got a pretty strong wind. The tide's all right. This is in a little cove over here. But this guy's still struggling to get this bad boy around the corner over there. And instead of loading one at a time, and maybe even loading the one that runs first, this guy's going all the different directions. This is making my ADD twitch. Now I'm not sure if he's doing all this because he's winded and not thinking about what's going on, but he's still trying to wrangle two of these jet skis at once. Now he's tying this one off. Man, I don't know what's going on here. He's tying this one off. He's trying to get one on the trailer. He's trying to take the furthest one away now and getting on the trailer. Now he's untying this one. Look at that, that jet ski totally disappeared. Where did it go? Oh, there it is. So he's in front of the dock there. He's got it all cockeyed and sideways. Well, his bud finally helps out and starts to slide this thing over. And he's trying to lift it over these bunks. That's like trying to drive a car over railroad tracks. This one goes a little bit smoother around the bend. And to be honest with you, I don't know which one was running and which one wasn't. Well, look at these two. These guys are riding butts and nuts coming in. And you're going to find out pretty soon that this guy in the front driving the ski, his truck's got a clutch problem. And that's why they're going over here to load it up. Well, back to the action over here. Let's see what these guys are doing. They get the second one on, kind of sideways. And that's again another reason when you know the trailer's too deep. Now our next contestant on the ramp is right to these two right here. Let's take a look at what's going on. She yanks it in and pulls that thing right in the dock. Swing and a miss. There we go, second time works. Well, she left the front cleat with one turn on it there. The boat about got loose. Look at this. And she cinches that thing down. Let's see it. Two, three, four, five. Loop, six, seven, eight. I think that was eight. That, that boat ain't going nowhere. That's going to be one of them floating boats if the tide goes out. Well, that's good. They got their boat sealed off there. And that captain gives these guys a hand. They're struggling to get over on the ramp over there. Now, he might be going on a sightseeing tour or something like that. He's looking for a spot over here. And there he goes. <laughs> Da -da 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 -da. Nice little 360 right there. Powers out. Comes in, does a 180 back to his original starting position. Nice form. That's some beautiful form right there. Making minimum wake in a minimum wake zone. Now where he's going, it's not a good idea to be going over here and beaching this thing. I'll show you why. Oh, there it is right there. All this area where we're at right here, it's nothing but rocks and shell. All oysters right there. And walking out with bare feet, that ain't fun either. Well, this guy with this trailer here backs it right down the middle there. There's people trying to come in.
Now a good set of hand signals are always important, especially when you're standing about three feet from each other. Sometimes you can't hear, and a good visual signal over an audible one will work out better. He sticks it in right there real slow, and then gives it to her. There he goes. He gets it on there again. He tells him go left. That's it. Straight on in. Bop. You got to take it slow when it's your first time and you ain't been out in a while. You only go as fast as you want to crash. Well, back to the gnats over here. They decided to get one last little oomph in. Maybe it's to dry out the hair or something like that. Well, back over to the original ski over here. I'm trying to figure out what they're doing. They're still working on this thing over here. Now, there's a perfectly good dock over there, but I learned that this guy's got clutch issues, and he don't think he can make it up out of the ramp. What y'all doing it here for? Shit. Oh, my truck, this clutch is getting a little, a little weird, so it's hard to get the truck off that ramp. Do you need help lifting it or something like that? We're gonna give it a well, I couldn't pass up this opportunity to see what's going on, and there it is. These poor guys are having some trouble. I figured I'd give them a hand if I could. Yeah, I'm going to give it a shot. It uh, depends on how this clutch wants to work out today. I hear you. I decided to take the boat out. Here's the trouble that you run into at this ramp over here. I got my daughter in the boat in front of me, wife's next to me over here, and the other boy, he's on the other side. And look at these guys, acting like fools. And what happened here allegedly is that one of the boats was waiting to come in and dock. The other two are blocking the ramp, or the other one's blocking the ramp. And then this guy comes in and sneaks there next to everybody, and everybody's mad and aggravated about it. Well, that's kind of what you're supposed to do. You go to the outside, go get your trailer, back it in, put the trailer in the water, Bring your boat around, next person goes and gets their trailer, they're next in line. That's kind of the etiquette. He hollers some pretty bad stuff. These guys are actually locals that he's yelling at. Now, while these people are headed out here, blasting through a no-wake zone, I want to invite you over to the website, creditcardcaptains.com. That way you guys can get some new merch that's out there. I want to thank you guys for watching, liking, subscribing. If you want to submit a video, send it in. I put an email in the description. I'll see you guys again soon. Thanks for watching.
And I was going to say, before this video is over, check out the link in the description, creditcardcaptains.com. You can get some merch down there. I'll see you guys soon. Well, he heads out of here after throwing a bunch of insults and some comments that I didn't want to put on here. It's kind of rude. Thanks for watching, liking, and subscribing.